Welcome back guys. Today I've got a quick review for you. It's a Frigidaire dehumidifier. Alright guys, here it is. It's a Frigidaire dehumidifier. I got it off of Amazon. I'm just going to kind of run over you guys a little bit about the machine, but the main reason why I got this is not because I have like an attic that has moisture issues or a basement. I got it just to help regulate the humidity within the apartment because here in the Midwest, which I hate, I hate the Midwest, it does get very humid. In case you guys couldn't tell, the, the unboxing went very well. It was very easy to take out, and it was packaged very well. On a serious note though, there was some damage to that top uh, styrofoam there in the corner of the box, on the like right there, but on the other side, a little bit damage, but it was kind of hard to get out, but that's not much of an issue though. All right, so as far as the unit goes, it's, it's a Frigidaire. It's the one that everybody has recommended on Amazon that everybody in general seems to have. It cost me off of Amazon about 250 bucks. Um, I did get the four year extended warranty for it, which ran me about 44 more dollars. So it's, it, well, the grand total was $281 after, after everything was done. So I was gonna get one from, you know, locally, like Home Depot or Lowe's. At Home Depot, they had a pretty generic one that was like 350 bucks and had a two-year warranty of like 40 bucks. So I went to Lowe's, which I, I do like Lowe's, and there was a, I can't remember the name, but it was a pretty popular brand and they wanted 240 something and then like 50 or 60 dollars for the two-year plan well amazon had a four-year plan for it and it was frigidaire which is the name that every everybody recommends on amazon so on the front of it there is a, like i just showed you that red line is for how much water you have in the unit i've been running this for about five hours now i have it set on 40 percent humidity I had it set at 35, but it can't maintain it because of the air conditioner. For some reason when the air conditioner kicks on, which we're going to get into that in a minute, it does, I guess, induce some sort of moisture in the air. I've not figured that one out because you can, your air conditioner is supposed to be a dehumidifier also. But, so I've got it set on 40, and it does run basically all the time. Noise-wise... It's about as loud as a box fan on high. It's not terribly loud, but overall, I think it's really nice. Um, some issues that I do want, do want to tell you about though. So many reviews I've seen from the very beginning of looking into dehumidifiers was that whenever you store them for the season and come back, they just don't work anymore. I did talk to some people at Lowe's that were buying them, and they said that that has actually never happened to them, so I don't know. Uh, get get the warranty though, so you can switch it out. And the Amazon is way that I went, and it is very, uh, very nice. So it it is the uh, fifty. It is the fifty pint model, which they say you do want because it only costs a little more than like the twenty five thirty and the twenty five or thirty five or whatever in the small models. But they work so much faster. They hold more in the tub down there. And also, if you want to continue to strain, there is a knob back there. Right there. I mean, not a knob, but a, uh, a hand, uh, turn it, and then you hook up a garden hose. It does not come, come with a garden hose. But overall, uh, that was the main thing I want to talk to you about, it, though. An issue that I'm having is, is this is my apartment. So we have the kitchen. We have the dining room. Living room and down to the hallway so it's not terribly big but it is obviously about 500 square feet and this thing runs continuously it's a very higher powered unit and because it runs continuously because um, dehumidifiers uh, put out 101 degree air right there I measured it this air conditioner is set on 
about 85 completely out of focus of course and it has been running the entire day the humidity is pretty nice actually it's out of focus also you know of course but it's 30 30 percent but i haven't really been on the been in the apartment much i've just been kind of in the apartment doing stuff overall yes i do love the fact that it is 85 degrees in here which i don't like that but it's so much easier to manage there's no humidity it's really nice the downside and to be honest with you i am going to return this because it's going to destroy my electric bill These alone do use a lot of electricity. They really do. They average about 10 cents an hour to run. And this has been off for a whole like two minutes because it caught up in the stock. And like I said, I'm not heating up an entire house. Well, sorry, dehumidifying an entire house. Now, what I recommend to anyone? Well, I don't know. Because dehumidifiers, all of them seem to have the same issue. But overall, this is nice. Um, with that said though, I do want to thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions for me, put it down in the comments. If you anything you want me to review or try, put it down in the comments. With that said, I want to thank you guys for watching. Have a great night.